this episode, we're going to have a look at JSON. And specifically, we're going to have a look at the included JBuilder on a Fresh Rails application. And there's a lot of different alternatives to JBuilder, with one of the more popular ones being the Active Model Serializers, but it hasn't been maintained for some time now. And I think as we are getting started with a Fresh Rails application, it's going to be important to just try to keep things as simple as possible and as the complexity grows or if we notice that we are having some performance issues and it's not the business logic that is causing the performance issue but perhaps it is the number of users we have or the underlying JSON building that's really causing a problem on our application, then we could look at something that's going to be a faster JSON renderer. However, in this case, I want to start off this application very simple and just use the included JBuilder. And one thing I do like about JBuilder is that its DSL that it provides is very simple. There isn't too many moving parts to know, and it works pretty well. So in this application, we're going to look at two different situations. We'll have an index where we have many records, and then we'll look at the show action for one of the records, where we're going to introduce some custom attributes, as well as dealing with some relationships. And then we're also going to look at active storage and just presenting these attachments as well. And we will look at a new Rails 7 feature around the active storage attachments in this episode where we are predefining the different variants. And we don't need to have an API only application to have a need for the JSON API. It could be an open API that we are providing to our users on our main application while we are still serving a full web application. And did you know that you can go to railstore.com to get your own Ruby on Rails t-shirt or your Drift and Ruby t-shirt? To watch this full episode and more videos, visit driftandruby.com and subscribe to the Pro Membership.